Greetings and welcome back to Dyson Sphere Program. I'm Catherine of Sky, and we're so close to finishing Purple Science. Oh my god, it's great. So the next thing we need to do is uh, we need to make sulfuric acid. That is the last ingredient we need for all the things. I have also remembered to change my stream deck to show this. Uh, we need nine machines making sulfuric acid. So that's not a whole lot. It's, it's very little, in fact. Um, so let's find out how to make it. Let's see. Let's put this, uh, let's just delete all of the arms on this. Figure out exactly what we need for sulfuric acid. Okay, we need three things. We need water, stone, and refined oil. That should be pretty easy. Okay, so oil, stone, water, things, stuff. More things, more stuff. So this is where the sulfuric acid is going to come in. So let's start by making that thing. Let's see, how do we want to do this? We could put it here. I guess maybe we do. We just put it here. Let's start on the ground level and chuck it on over here. Um, but here, we're going to have to go up. Oh, that's quite nice. Look at how beautiful that ended up being. Wow, I'm impressed. All right, so it is getting sprayed right there. Now then, uh, here we go. We're gonna turn this around. So we have the output coming on right there. So this is output of sulfuric acid right now. I think I can put a couple of machines here. Let's put in the, uh, oh, actually these belts need to go the other way. They need to come this way, actually. So again, oil, stone, and water. We have so much water here. Um, it's almost a shame to use this area for this stuff. Maybe I'll just put it on this coast or something like that. Okay, so this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we might have to go like all the way down this uh, line there. We'll just prepare for it and then take up the extra belts we don't need, as is our usual pattern of things. So I'm going to go ahead and spray the things on entry here. So let's grab a sprayer. Uh, okay, this is where they're going to connect. You know what? Let's try to... We can maybe shift them a tiny bit. There we go. Let's see if we can get them in line with this thing. That would be nice. Okay, there we go. And you go down here. Somehow I didn't add that one there. Okay, spray, spray, and more spray. Why collide with object? Okay, I think it's this thing. Maybe it's not long enough. I hate when these things... Like, it, you can trim it down to the last belt. It's like, why doesn't it fit? Like, hello, thing. Hello, we need your stuff. Okay, so let's get our first power pole there and sprayers can be active. Now, I don't think we're going to actually need any more spraying beyond this. I think this is the end. This is literally the end of the line here. So let's grab, uh, we need to make sulfuric acid. So we need those three different things. Actually, we'll copy this because it has those inserters. And this is one little click there. And then we need, again, the other inserter there. So we're going to copy this along. I'm going to go ahead and just be very frugal with the distances here. See if we can sneak more in as we did on the other area. I don't know. These don't seem like they're going to cooperate in that way, but we'll, we'll check it out and we'll see. Again, we need nine of these machines. That's five. Ugh, this might not fit. Six. Seven eight and hmm, I think what we'll do is we'll lift this a tiny bit this area doesn't need to be lifted a whole lot just enough to go over those belts maybe what I do is also go do this thing here and just like connect it that way okay so let's go up one I don't want to go over the entire machine because I feel like that's weird so let's just uh, get these off because it does not like to connect to a slope Okay, and that way we can just connect one machine. I'm going to try to just copy paste this instead of dragging all the belts individually. And just sneak it on in here. That's nice. That way we can just... Wait, hello? We have no more belts? No! Help! 
Uh, this makes me physically ill, this whole, like, lack of belts thing. That makes me very unhappy. Like, superbly unhappy. Should have just trimmed these, I guess. We would have had enough. All right, we do need to go back and see if we can get some belts because we need to still connect all that stone and other stuff up here. But for now, why don't we go ahead and... Wait, am I using green? No, I'm using blue inserters. Perfect. That's what we want. Actually, I probably should do... No, it's okay. It doesn't really matter. I was just thinking of like... Where, where, where I should put these power poles if I should put them on the lower side. But I don't think so. I think that uh, we may not have anything down here. We may just have, or maybe just water, maybe. All right, let's go go shopping. Let's go to the mall. Man, I really wish I had, well, you know, I say I wish I had drones to deliver stuff to me, but right now we're causing that problem on our own because we're making everything into these belts. Are we actually getting belts? No, we have no belts. We have nothing right now. This is so sad. We have no green engines. I'm just like, where are the damn green engines? Because we have so many. We have many that we're, we're, our, we're requesting them a very low number. So as soon as there are 100 in the box, we're like, come on over, come on over. All right, well, I'm just going to craft some myself in that case. So, uh, or even better. You know what? I'm going to put all these green motors into this box here. And we're going to make our own belts. So go there. Green motors, you go there. We're going to paint them all. Make sure they're all painted properly. And then we're going to make green belts in this thing. There we go. Because we are going to get... No, we're not going to get the... Oh, of course not. No, it doesn't matter if they're painted. Of course, of course. Should we... Nah, we don't care about production speed up. I'm just going to put them in here. And they can be just used. Actually, you know what? I do care about the green motors. Uh, those should be painted. Because if the thing... If we end up making something else in this construction... Not that we really will. But uh, if we end up doing that... Oh, whoops. No. If we end up doing that, then we need to have that available. So I'm going to just delete some of these items. Delete. Delete. And coal. Do we really need this much coal? Maybe. I don't know. Here, eat this coal, please. Enjoy it. I feel like a very bad Santa Claus or something. Eat this coal! Don't I have a coal box somewhere? That's like working on this? I don't know. Uh, we also have this stuff, which is unpainted. Of course it's unpainted, yes, because that's what we want to do. Ay ay ay. Okay, let's put this box here. This is going to serve up the... this stuff so that it gets painted. And then coal box is over here. I completely forgot about this. There we go. Alright, so that's something done. Let's see, we have a little bit of iron ore and a little bit of copper. Let's see if I can just put that somewhere. Here, you take this iron. We have copper and silicon. You know what? I'll just put that into a box over here. This box. You know, this is our junk box. I feel like this is a safe place to chuck everything we don't need. All right, that's fine. I think I'll put some of this other stuff back in... I think I, I should return this to the tower for goodness sake that should go definitely back to the tower these can go in here maybe this too this stuff that's unpainted or badly painted let's put that back in for repainting all right and then plastic you know what I'll just deliver plastic back to where it goes all right do we have oh my god wow there's this is full like really full? I think I'm gonna cut this belt because I don't know that we actually need all of this stuff here. Let's see, let's find out. That's so weird that it's backed up here. Cause I thought that it would be there's there's still room in these uh in these boxes. Oh wait, what am I doing? Oh god, I'm collecting things I don't need. So those go back there. Yeah, there's still room in these boxes. Why was it backing up? I don't get that. It doesn't seem to have put any of the belts in there. That's interesting. 
So. All right, whatever. It doesn't really matter. Let's go and um, go back to our construction over here. Alt, alt. God, I, I hate when I press spacebar accidentally. It's like, no, this is bad. Okay, so we need water. We need the oil. Where is that oil that we had? Is that this here? Here's the oil? Yeah? It's weird that it doesn't show it on the splitter, like what's in there. That's a strange, strange thing. Okay, so let's take this. I wonder if this needs to be stacked at all. I'm kind of curious about that. Um, I'm also wondering if I should do something different here, and I think I will. I think what I wanna do here is do a different type of splitter so that it's quite easy to to put on the second level because that's what I want to do otherwise we're gonna have to put all of these belts on the second level and that doesn't make any sense to me all right let's go back to zero and connect there please and this is also at zero connect there okay that's good now then this is on zero level as well this is painted so technically this does not need painting I guess let's go ahead and take off the painter we don't need to paint it twice uh is this oil i'm gonna look on our uh thingy again let's see this is one and a half belts i feel like we don't have enough throughput here i think we need a uh i think we need a stacker here somewhere obviously we need a stacker or a piler uh hmm how do you do that <laughs> it's so crowded it's like no there's too much too much here i think what we may need to do is just split it in half i think that's what we need to do so let's see we'll go here is about half that is going to be yeah that's the correct belt let's go ahead and just delete that and have it go the other way you know what we could do though? Oh, look what we could do. Hold on, hold on, we have the solution. We just upgrade it. Hey, that's much easier. So let's put in our belts, sorters, whatever, there. Good, good, good. So that makes us not have to worry about this split. So splitting it's gonna be like, I think it's around half and half. Let's check on this thing and see where it's going. Okay, so oil here. So we have 0.8 and 0.7. So it is very much half and half. So we don't need to worry about blue belts going to either of these places. So that's great. This is actually great. So greatness has been achieved right there. So the next thing we need is much, much water. I'm going to go ahead. Oh, we're still up. Okay. Um, water is under this. Here it is. Okay. So we need half a belt of water. Wow. And that's seven water thingies geez that's a lot or seven per second we need to check how many that is per water maker i have no idea i i water is such a like a mysterious thing i feel because we rarely use it i think that's the reason why it's mysterious is because we almost never use these things uh this is probably too close i think so we'll just do it on this side and this is actually a great place to have this too so that's three, four, five, six, seven. How many is it per second? Does it tell us? Let's grab that over here and then can we put them in between maybe? Okay, so if this is working, it's 70 per minute, which is seven per second. But the, wait a second, let's see. If we look back here, what does it say for water? Water pump eight. I am now even more confused. Wow. <laughs> Is that possible to be more confused than this? I don't know. All right, whatever. Um, but it does say that all that water flows on one belt, right? Yeah, a half a belt, in fact. Half a green belt. So we could technically put this on a yellow belt if we wanted to, according to this thingy. All right, let's just add all of this stuff together and... Put in these connections and hopefully we will make this work somehow magically we're working with magic here 
are. There we go. Nice. All right, so that one is going to go over there. Now, the next thing is rock. We need some stone. I don't know where the nearest stone is, but we'll look. Let's see. Did we already grab all the stone? Oh, wait, we have more oil down here? Oh, wow. Look at this. Okay, we need. We may need to fly that in. There's crude oil. I think that one's tapped. Do we have any stone? I believe we've actually tapped all of the stone on this planet. This is this is a definitely different experience, I gotta say. Oh, there's some over here. I think what I'll do is tap both of these and put them in a tower, both of them. Uh, that one is tapped already. Okay, let's just do that. I think, yeah, it's definitely a different experience. I feel like I don't even have enough to do purple science, let alone green science. So that's something that's a new experience for me. Normally, like, we're just overburdened with resources, even at 1x. So this is a very different feeling of a playthrough. I kind of recommend it. You know, I think it's kind of cool. It's like, huh, okay, this is weird. Weird is good, though. We can do weird. Weird is just fine. It's always good to have something to shake up, you know, your status quo. Because, I mean, otherwise it gets boring, I think. Okay, so let's put this stone in a tower. I think we have a distribution of stone already in different areas, but you know, can't hurt to have some more. Oh, this is gonna be naughty. Jeez, look at that, barely fits, kinda. There. Wait, why didn't that function? Hello? Give? Eh? Doesn't wanna give me that last one, which I wanted so badly. All right, it's fine. Whatever. It's not important. Okay, we can't do the other side. So those are one set. I don't know if we can put one on this side at all. I think it's just... Oh, we can! Beautiful. Okay, cool. I watched this really great music stream, and it was so good because, like, the, um, the presenter was, like, talking about difficult topics, and I'm like, this is so great. I, I absolutely love talking about hard topics, kind of like, you know, emotional vulnerability and awareness and stuff like that, and it was so great, and it was hard topics, but people were so into it, and it's like, yeah, this is just what I needed today. It was awesome. So, yeah, really good. I might feature that person that I'm thinking uh, on YouTube because, like, it was such a... Like, a valuable thing to experience, you know? Okay, there we go. Okay, and this... Oh, it actually stayed! Look at that! Beautiful. That's fun. I like when, when things, like, do their job here. <laughs> okay, so you are going to hold stone, and that is going to be your job. You're a great tower, and we love you. There we go. Okay, so let's put in some, tower, some uh, little pets here. Drones. Tower pets. We should call them tower pets, right? There we go. Ten of those. You're going to be the supply for all the things and all the stuffs. So we're going to get what we can. That is the object of this uh, particular strategy right now. We're going to do what we can. Let's go there and then connect here. That's fine. I remember, wow, in the last series, like, so many of this happened. Now it's so much less. Like, it used to happen constantly if you haven't played DSP before. Um, and by the way, if you haven't bought DSP yet, it is so worth uh, your money, I think. Because it is really a really good game. And I love it. It's, it's like... Um, I don't know if Factorio or if this is my favorite Factory game, but they are darn close. Really darn close. And um, I can't say for sure. But just know they're great. They're really great. And I... Oh, wow. I didn't even notice this tower over here. Whoops. I should have put them in here. Oh, well. I've already set it up. It's fine. So this tower has... You know what? I'm going to get this coal in a tower while we're here. Might as well. I think we're going to need every single like ounce of resources on this planet. But this is also good because like when we run out of coal for like painting or whatever, it's like, oh yeah, we already have some in a tower. It's gonna be fine. So we don't have to like redo that, which is nice. Of course, we are suffering a tiny lack of belts, which is a bit rough, 
Um, so that's why I'm using these blue belts because they have such a high throughput. I think it's going to be enough even for, I mean, like you see these, those are not at all running out of space. Uh, alternatively, we can also go for a stacker. That is also an option. As in the piler machine. Okay, so these are done. Is that gonna... Yep, it messed that one up. But the, I, to be fair, I'm going very close. I'm like testing the limits here of these things. Uh, okay. Are they all... Nope, one more. Okay, fine. Okay, so now we have coal. Let's make sure we have a place for that here. And we don't have any ships on this one. Okay, that must have been where we were like out of them or something. Because like now I'm just like... Anything that has local deliveries of raw ores, I'm putting 20 small ships on it. Let's put in 100 there and 100% here as well. Okay, so there we go. Happy days are here again. And I'm going to put in a tower there. Nice. Excellent. This is pretty good. Pretty excellent. This one is... Is this requesting? Some uh, is partially requesting, partially... All right, so I'm going to put in ships. I like having each of our towers being really independent and every one of them having ships. I mean, now we're making ships en masse, so it's it's a good good time for us. We are the ship people right now. Uh, also, if you have ships in a tower, you need to power it. If you don't, you don't, technically. So let's go and go back to our place. And now we can request um, stone. Wait, is this? No. Where? Uh, is it further? Might be further. Yes, it's over here. Okay, good. So now we get to do the tower request thing over here to request some stone. So we're, we'll put in we'll put in this belt over here. I think. How much stone do we actually need? Let's look at our thingy. Of course, we have no <laughs> no concept whatsoever. It looks like one green belt is enough. Okay, so that's fine. We probably actually generated that, I'm thinking. I don't know for certain, but I'm thinking we might have already generated that amount. So let's put this in here. We'll put the water in here as well. And we'll put our tower in here as well. You know what? I'm going to put that tower here because this is kind of a wasted chunk right now. Uh, so I'm going to put it right there. It's going to make the belt a tiny bit longer, but I'd rather not mess up this really long, beautiful stretch by putting a tower right in the middle. Uh, alternatively, oh, you know what? I could put it here. I think it's over here is much better. Uh, this spot there. Yes. Okay, that's where we want this stuff to be. Not because it's extremely convenient, but because that t piece of land would be unused otherwise. So this tower is going to request stone. And maybe do like a thousand stone and local demand. And we'll also do remote demand just in case we need stuff from far off lands. Uh, and we will because I am sure that this planet is going to run out of resources fairly quickly. Now this episode, we might stock them all with all of the things because I'm kind of tired of running out of stuff in other places like the power poles. That was so dumb. Like that was not necessary at all. Uh, and yet it happened. It was a bad time. It was really just silly. Okay, so stone has been delivered. Hooray. This, I think we need a long distance pull. Note that uh, if you connect long distance poles, you don't have to do long distance to long distance. They can connect to short power poles as well. Oh my god, look at that. It looked like a centipede. That was freaky. Kind of cool. Oh yeah. All right, and we got our stone. There it goes. So let's see stuff get made. We have our first sulfuric acid made. All right, that's getting painted. Going to here. Let's check on power. We have 100% power. This is great. Let's check a power pole and see how close we are to demise. We are so far from not having enough. This is great. Okay, next set. I love this. So this is like what I was thinking for the other planet with the motors. Like have everything in a line. If we didn't have this coast here, it would be one straight line of painting. But since we're doing the no landfill thing, uh, obviously we got to kind of move stuff around uh, as the coast moves and we can start. And we, we just want to have the maximum land available. But yeah, we are having stuff working. Check that out. 
Our first bundles of fiber optic stuff are here. Now we do have a tiny problem with hydrogen. <laughs> we, we have too much hydrogen. So what I'm going to do, I think, um, is I think we're going to wait. Why? Wait, wait, do we have a part place where we're actually processing? We do. Maybe we might, we might hold on. Uh, I just had a thought, uh, we need to do something with the hydrogen. Otherwise these plants are going to shut down. So let's get this thing and we need to kind of do an upward thingamahopper that way. All right, let's go down again here. Um, all right. And then let's see, let's get rid of this. Okay. So this hydrogen, I think we're just going to take it and combine it with the other hydrogen in the other area. How far is that away? It's quite far. I think let's go and look. So maybe we can put it behind here or something or figure out a way. So the other hydrogen goes here. So maybe we just put it inside like this. Let's do a rotation like this so that it goes inside this, uh, this thingy majingy. Oh, lack of item. God dang it thing. All right, let's go back to the mall and see if we can fix this. Maybe we got a few more belts made. We can hope. Come on, go, go, go. Let's go. Let's get belts. Ugh. Sometimes WAC just like sort of stops respawning. It's a very peculiar thing. All right, let's see what we got over here. Did, do we have any more belts? Yes, we have eight. Yay, we have eight. We have more of these though. That's good. Uh, that's nice. We, we're not out of blue motors for whatever reason. We have blue, but we just don't have the green. Now we should have green. We have so many belts here. Um, I'm kind of I'm not sure if I really want to go to blue yet. It's a big step and it's a lot more materials and it's like, oh, those are expensive. <laughs> That's what it feels like anyway. It's like, oh, those are expensive. Maybe and maybe here, maybe the, the solution is not to maybe the solution here is not to build a belt. Maybe it's to just add from the tower, you know? I think that's a better idea actually. So let's see, can we do that? Let's just add hydrogen. Maybe this one can request it. I don't know. Let's request it. Local supply. Sure. We could do local demand here, actually put it at a thousand. And this is another gigantic storage container. Uh, we'll put in some, some ships here. I need to go and grab more ships. It looks like 20 in one stack. Hooray. Oh, 28 actually. Never mind. Eh. Well, with that many thingies, I guess it's fine. Okay. Let's get this hydrogen out of here. And maybe we put this on a blue belt actually for reasons that there is tons of it. Let's go there and down from there. Wow, these containers are empty. I'm surprised about that. Like really surprised. Uh, all right, and then now here, we're going to just delete that belt that we started constructing. Uh, there we go. Nice. Because I think we don't need it. Let's see, this one is full. This tower is completely full, but we can put it in this tower. I think that's a good compromise actually. So, down and into there. Very good. All right. So now the hydrogen is going to come into this tower and this will be a supply uh, section for this. And that's good because it's good to have hydrogen available. So we're just going to leave the limit at everything. 10,000 can be stored here which is kind of great. So we now have a functional area. Now then we need to figure out where are we actually doing the science part of this? Uh, because that is not clear. We started a mini science section, I feel somewhere. So we have the processors made on another planet. Uh, are we actually making science over here? We could, we could. So science is happening here. 
we can clear all this out and make actual science here. I think that's a good idea, actually. Let's clear all of this out. Let's get our mass delete tool. This is a bit scary, but here we go. Okay, okay. Okay, that actually was there, wasn't it? Okay, I may need to fix some of this. I need to fix because I was messy. I was very messy. Look at this. This actually goes here. Uh-huh. But look at these like little curly U's. That's quite cute. Very cute. But we don't need cute right now. We don't need this stuff. Let's take that off. These are going into yellow. Somebody reminded me that I might have an issue with some of the blue makers. Like that was like ages ago. Oh, <gasps> they're right. Wait, are they right? Yes. There's no output for these guys. I cannot believe this. This is no wonder we're not getting any blue stuff made, but we are always over capping on the blue anyway. So it's not really an issue, I think. I'm gonna go ahead and just do the over. There we go. I don't know if we have any inserters for those. Yeah, we do have inserters. We just didn't have the outserters. I mean, yeah, the, the, the takey outy bits. Yeah. Mm-hmm or insert onto the opposite line. So what is this stuff? This is plastic. Okay, I feel like we can delete this completely. Yes, sorry, we're done, thank you. You have served your factory well, my friends. You have served your factory well. So now I'm gonna take off this stuff and we're gonna, we're going to import the stuff we need. So we're going to take off this Take off this and this, and we're going to import instead the particle broadband, which we have in the other tower. So I'm going to put in like 500 or maybe, maybe we'll do uh, 200. So local demand, because we know it's made here. Okay. They're only sending two ships for it. I'm going to go ahead and do like a hundred percent here with this stuff. And that means all we need to do is connect this up here. To particle broadband. Oh, no, no, I missed it. There we go. All right. Perfect. Perfect. That means these. Also, I need to upgrade those inserters. I don't know if it matters, but yeah, there we go. Now, we do know that those... Um, we do know that something happened there. Uh, we do know that these are painted, the, those things, so we don't need to paint them. All right, and how tall are these? Not tall enough, apparently. Lack of item. No, why do we have a lack of item? We, we're making stuff like this. Let's go, let's go shop. I think the, um, those are made somewhere. No, they're made over there. That's right, because we needed glass for them and we still don't have the glass automatically sent over here. Talk about laziness. Like, yeah, it's fine, it's fine, whatever. Uh, we're gonna take that, that's fine. Now then, we have so much material that needs to be returned to sender. Let's go over to get the uh, this hydrogen back in this tower. Uh, there you go. Take that. Do we have any stone that can be put in here? No, doesn't look like it. Diamonds, green diamonds uh, and plastic. Where is that stuff? Do we have any of that? Green diamonds can go here. Okay, great. Uh, titanium, we have some of that as well. Let's just put stuff where it belongs, why not? This can be deleted. And then plastic, hmm. I forget, are we making plastic out here? Completely forgotten. And all of these nanotubes and stuff as well can go in here because those are needed. Oh, here's the plastic. Okay, so plastic can be just inserted into all of these machines. This is a very annoying way of doing this, by the way. Like, I wish they would hold more like Factorio machines hold like a hundred or something most of the time. So having to like split these up into tiny stacks is not ideal. I forgot on the other side, they will take it as well. Good. I should just put this on a belt. That's what I really should do. Like the graphene. I think we'll put graphene on a belt. So the graphene is made here, which means we can have a belt here uh, with a box and just put it on. Okay, graphene. 
right? We just want to make sure it's the right product, because if it's not, we're going to mess this up really badly. Now, nanotubes are going to have the same kind of deal. They're on this side here. There we go. Nanotubes, hooray! I like this kind of like recycling because it's pretty useful. Anything else? No, it looks like we're pretty good on everything else except for particle broadband. And that can go into the tower, I feel. Hello? Oh, that's just hydrogen. Particle broadband is in this tower. There you go. Okay. Not bad. Cleaned up the inventory very nicely. I'm going to go and put in those pink uh, dumbbells, barbells, uh, because those also do not belong in our inventory. Okay. Jumpy, jumpy. All right. Get rid of litter. I think it was mostly random stuff. Okay. Let's see. What is here? Pink barbells. There you go. Pink dumbbells, barbells, whatever you want to call it. Oh, I should put these back in there. The photon combiners. Anyway, we're doing pretty well. Let's go and return the paint. We have uh, three canisters of paint. I feel like that's something that probably could just be chucked in a random tower. I think a lot of the problem with the tower is like the reason you don't have it. Like in Factorio, you have one item at a time. And in this game, you have like minimums of how much uh, a thing will collect. So it won't collect if you put like five something in a box. Um, it'll only collect if you have like a hundred so yeah that's not ideal let's go shopping for expensive stuff like ships and towers and stuff that's going to be over here look at our factory it is like massive right now isn't it crazy good i'm just like wow we built a lot of stuff it's taken a while but you know it works it's good all right small towers we have one I don't know how we keep getting these, by the way. I have no clue where they are coming from because I don't recall ever picking them up. It's like, huh? Let's see. Okay, so let's get like 20 of them. That's good. And then we'll stick five back in just to like reduce stacks. I also want to pick up uh, these guys. Ships, uh, not here, of course. The ships would not be there because I didn't put them there. They are instead over here. Let's pick up a few of these. Let's put in one stack there. Um, let's see, another 10 can go back, I guess. And then these guys, let's pick up another 50 or 90 or something. There we go, 91. I think that's going to leave us with, yeah, three, three, two and a half stacks, basically or close, depending on how pedantic you are. You might be horribly pedantic, and that's like, no, KOS. That is exactly 2.6 something stacks. Yeah, 2.74 stacks. Right, um, hmm. Let's see, I also wanna get the, this is really hard to navigate, by the way, with too many towers here. Uh, I'm looking for assembly machines right now. Hello? Shopping? Shopping! There we go. We're going to recycle these guys and pick up these guys. Yay. Let's pick up a bunch of... Let's pick up like 400. That sounds cool. That's the, whoa, that's way too many. Hold on. Hold on! Uh, let's put half of them back because I don't want to carry that many stacks. I'm kind of particular about like having not full stacks and stuff like that. Sorry about this. Okay, so we now have a situation where we need to put in many of these other items into towers. We're also having the situation where uh, <laughs> we have too many towers close together, which is not ideal. Definitely not ideal. We can put one here. Let's go ahead and put stuff in here. We want to do various items. Let's just clear all these out. Uh, we'll put in power poles. I don't know if we need long distance power poles. I feel like we don't. Let's get in wind turbines. Let's see. Uh, storage. No, splitters. Miners. We're going to do it by propinquity. Let's see. Miners and splitters. Mm -hmm. There you are. Okay, and then like these, I want to have a limit of like, let's make a thousand of these, for example. I don't think we need more than that. 
Let's make a thousand of those. Sure, maybe like 600, uh, you know what? Five or two, 300 miners because we're gonna go to the bigger miners as soon as we can. Let's put in like 200 splitters. And that seems like, I mean, like splitters, when are you ever going to use 200 splitters? That's like nuts. It's like way too many. Okay. So here, because these belts are not used, I'm going to delete them. I'm going to delete them and just raise them up to this level so that we can easily get these items out. I think that's a good idea. Uh, there we go. Like this. That's working nicely. So let's get those out. So these can actually be on very slow belts. It's really not necessary to think of anything more, uh, fat, anything faster than that. Let's put them like this. This is going to be like this and going to connect in under their land. Okay. Very good. Oh, we need to go over one more tile. It looks like instead. because we have this one over here, which I'm not sure if it's going to go there, but let's leave a pathway open for it just in case. So let's get in our thingies. There you go. And you go in there. Sorry for the moo cow noise. This, this is a bit like, uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you got it. You know what it's like. All right. And then down. Sure. Up. And down. Okay, so that's two items. All right. And that way we only need like one stack here. Just a place for this stuff to land. We don't even need a whole stack in here at all. We just, um, yeah. I think with this, we're going to put it on the second floor. I feel like that's the best way to do this is just do a second floor thingy because it's going to be really hard to get this belt finagled that way. So when you're doing second floor stuff, it's up to, uh, from the first, uh, part of this. So let's go there and like that, I think. Yeah. And then we can go down to zero again. And this one will go down. Oh my gosh, I think my ma is cooking something that smells really nice. Wow, that's nice. Okay. So yeah, that, that is a thing. Um, this is also needs to go bye-bye. Just cleaning things up. There we go. Okay. So that is going to work there. Now then, uh, we have miners. Oh yeah, we needed miners and smelters. Let's put the both of those in there. So we have miners, splitters, and let's do smelters. Do we have these? Yes, we do. Okay. So smelters also, again, we're going to do, let's do a thousand in here. I hope that's enough because, you know, we're going to have like massive smelting planets. I think, uh, I might do these also on a, oh no, I'm not. Hold on. We can do them very easily around this tower like this. I think that's going to work quite easily. This tower has no more space, right? Yeah, it's fine. So we don't need to worry about that at all. So these can just go across here very simply and easily and just go around. And actually maybe what we do is put them underneath these uh, copper lines. I think that could be better. Save space. Um, I'll put them on yellow belts because we don't need to have them going anywhere else. Rotate and do something like that. Uh, though, wait a second, that one's going under here. The other one will be going under the other one. So we need to kind of plan this a tiny bit. Okay, there we go. That's what we want. There we go. This is what we're going to want underneath here. This is so nice. I love this like levels and layers of belts. It's so much nice spaghetti. It's great. <laughs> Okay, so there we go. Let's go ahead and limit these other boxes like we did with the others and just go to like one stack. And the one stack is basically just a space for it to land in because otherwise it can't output. So 
What we could do is we could transfer it directly to a belt, but eh, it's fine. I'm, I'm okay with this. So now the next thing we have, we have these three items here, which is we have boxes, we have matrix labs or, and or water pumps. I don't know. Is that, is any of that like really critical? Probably not critical. We can kind of remember to bring it with us or we can actually just put it in a tower. There is this tower over here, which might be a good spot. Maybe we'll do that. Let's just take those over there. I think that's a good idea. Um, it looks like this belt is not used at all. So I'm just going to delete part of this and then we're going to have our outputs for these various items. So let's go there. Okay. And then you also are going to go this away. We're just going to just like do them all together and just be like friendly. All three going to school together at the same time. Yay. Hold hands. Let's go. <laughs> and, but we'll also learn as we're doing this to like, okay, how high do we need to be to go over this section here? Looks like this high, like really high. Um, we'll go here. So then we'll do the same here. And in this way, it's really easy just to drag them all together instead of like worrying about like, oh my God, we have to, yeah. Oh wait, let's see. Okay, let's go here with this. And you just drag them one at a time and it makes it very, very simple to make sure everything gets to be in its proper place. Alrighty. Alright, so there we go. Beautiful. Oh no, 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 no. Nye. Oh, that was bad. Okay, so never mind. Apparently that didn't work the way I wanted it to. I was going to do all of these down to zero. Okay, that's the minimum distance we can do with that. I'm going to go down to zero. I can just clicking zero every time. So if you didn't know zero on the numpad, probably on the other things as well will let you just go down to ground level without going down, down, down arrow. You just press zero and it goes. Oh, that's nice. It's like a roller coaster. Beautiful. So what are these items? Again, we have, let's see, we've got, okay, water pump, matrix lab. Oh, and we messed up the matrix lab as well. Oh God. Okay. We need to set the filter on this one to be only the matrix lab because it let out all the glass as well, I'm sure. And these are boxes. Okay, so matrix lab, boxes, and water. Water. Okay, let's just add these. Storage. I'm not making the big boxes because I don't feel like they're worth the space. They're, I don't think that they are actually beneficial. So, and plus the, the smaller boxes hold more than enough for almost everything. Uh, you really don't need a lot of buffer in this game. You want to have throughput, not buffer. Okay, what was the other thing? Matrix lab? Okay. And then the other one was water. Aha, I remembered everything. That's amazing. That's like a miracle. Because my brain is not very good at this. Okay, so let's see. Water pumps, let's have 200. Matrix labs, let's have 500. Boxes, let's have 200. We really don't need very many of these. Okay, so... Did, does, did it put glass in here? What is this? These are more boxes? It's just like rejecting more boxes? Yeah, I guess so. Okay, you know what? Maybe we used up all the glass. Maybe we used up all of it. That could be. Um, what I could do actually is use this tower and import glass. Mm, that's a smart thing. Okay, let's do that. Let's just do that. Or, wait, is there stone coming in anywhere here? No, nobody has stone. Stone doesn't turn into glass, I think. We need, I mean, stone bricks. Let's import glass, because why not? Uh, we'll just get a hundred at a time. Local demand. And we'll put in some thingies to go get it. Also, I don't care if there's 19. I am not worried about that. I know a lot of people do worry about like, oh my God, it's one off. I'm going to die. No, you're not going to die. Trust me. Dying is a lot harder to do than that. Okay. Trust me because I almost died previously. I was in the hospital at some point and they told me that I almost died. No joke. And I'm not saying this for dramatic effect. It is absolutely true. 
So let's see, we can't really do this. It looks like we need to do something like that maybe, and then we can go down. Yeah. Now then, the question is, how do I get that to that box? I don't think I can do this, but maybe, yeah, let's, well, can we, can we? Can we be sneaky like this? I don't think so, actually. However, what we can do is be a tiny bit sneakier. Okay, that was just messy right there. That was bad. We can go down one. And this is still up what? Oh, actually, we need to go up two. Yep. If we're up two, then we can go here and put it in the second story. Wait, how did that happen? That was weird. I guess because I copied it, it, oh, God. All right. I'm just going to be careful with what I'm doing here. Let's go and get glass in a tower now. So that glass we were picking up from here, I think. This is sprayed as well, which is very nice. Uh, do we have a tower here? There is a tower there. Let's put glass in there. Let's just store, I don't know, a thousand. We don't really need a lot. Let me put in here a, and actually what we can do with this is output this onto the line. I don't think we'll ever get rid of this glass, but <laughs> we can hope, right? This is going to be hopes and prayers. There we go. And then, then we go into second level. Oopsies. The BAC failed me. Failed me. No. Okay. We need to go up one more level. I see. So we'll go here. We can actually go over this entire thing. That's a bit nuts. Okay. Let's go here then. Ah. Oh. So this is, how far is this? Two more or something like that. Okay. Perfect. Beautiful. Look at this. Ah, oh, this is going to be great. All right, so glass is arriving. This is very nice. Hooray. Okay. So yeah, this is kind of great. This is really great. Things are happening very beautifully. And now we have, I think we have everything in this part of the mall in a tower. We don't have intermediate products, but that's okay. I think we can just like handcraft them if we really need them. Do we have belts? Yeah, we have a couple. We have five. We have five belts. Oh my god, we have masses of blue belts. Okay, it might be start time to start switching at this point. Now then, there are these items here, which also need to go into a tower. Sprayers, really important. Let's put those in. God, it's getting really dark in here. I need to fix that. Okay, and then we have, I think those are oil refineries. Uh, are they this or this? Extractors. Okay, that's fine. Let's just put this at a thousand and uh, extractors maybe at 200. There aren't going to be a lot of extractors, I guarantee you, needed. So I guess, ooh, this is going to be rough, man. I'm going to be some sneaky, sneaky business going on here. Let's put that one in there. Extractors. And then this one can be lift up as soon as you can and go down afterward. Oops, let's go here. Okay, very nice. Let's get those settled. And then of course we need to limit our boxes. Let's go and limit all the boxes now. Actually, what we can do is uh, better, better than that. We can do this instead. Oh, God. That was just painful, honestly. Oh, build better, KOS. Build better. Don't do these silly things like this. Okay, there we go. So we don't have even those boxes to mess things up. Okay, so the next tower is going to need three things. Oh, I don't want to do that. Let's do this. Collect tower. Can I do here? Yeah, good. Very good. So this is going to be what? This is oil what? These are refineries. Okay. So again, have to clear it manually. Why do we have to do this? This is ridiculous. Come on. Don't do this. Okay. So refineries, which are here. Then we have chemical plants, which are here. 
Let's have a thousand of those. I don't think there's a replacement for those or refineries. Uh, what else do we have here? These are fractionators. Okay. Uh, I guess so. Sure. Why not? Fractionators. We also need, you know what we also don't have? We don't have particle colliders made. That may be on our docket to do next. Because I think we are going to need a few for something. I forget what's made in those. I know you can make deuterium, but the, I am not going to make deuterium in those. That is not a good idea. To, it's way too much energy usage. Here, is it this? Yeah, okay, good. So let's do limits on these guys. A thousand, sure, a thousand. Let's make fractionators, sure, a thousand is fine. Or maybe like 500. Because right now we have more deuterium than we know what to do with, to be perfectly honest. All right, so these are going to go here. And you will go there. And we'll just take these these and just put the X. This is the, this is the ideal way. Like the other part of the mall, uh, it was more convenient to have the boxes because of the way it was crowded together. But in general, you're going to want to do something like this and just go straight to the belt instead, if you can. And like this, we had plenty of space, so yes, of course we could. Now then, we have way too many of all these things. So let's go ahead and remove some of them. These are water pumps. Okay, these are oil refineries. I can put in a few. We actually need quite a lot of them. So let's see, chemical plants. I'll just put in one stack. Fractionators, we I'm just gonna put them all in because I'm not I only build those like at very specific times. They are one purpose only. They don't have any other like mitigating circumstances. So you really don't need them otherwise. So now let's see, can we build those other things? You know what? We, we probably shouldn't because we're actually out of time in this episode. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put some power here and then we're going to add some ships. Uh, maybe local ships. Sure. I don't think we'll really need it, but... I usually just come shopping. But anyway, um, we're going to have these things available to us in other universes. Uh, I mean, the, the other parts of the galaxy, really. Uh, this is pretty exciting. Oh, there's coal here. Hey, that looks like an untapped resource. We might have to just put that in a tower as well. But anyway, uh, thank you so very much for joining me. Uh, I'm really excited about this. And uh, yeah really, really happy about this playthrough. It is so much fun. So thank you again for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.